What's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I hope everyone is having an amazing morning so far. As you guys just saw in the clips before, I finally went to the dentist again to my ortho appointment because through the whole COVID-19, obviously they were closed and we couldn't do appointments. And I went in yesterday and basically, let me just talk to you guys a little bit about what happened. So I've had my braces for so freaking long now. And honestly, I didn't feel like my teeth were super bad, but I've had them for almost three years, which is a long time when they told me that I was only going to have them for like 18 months. But the thing is that um, they're, they've been trying to fix my bite with rubber bands. And I've been wearing rubber bands and all that stuff, but unfortunately, um, my bite is still not fixed. So what they wanted to do is that they wanted to take out four teeth. So um like two from the top and two from the bottom and at this point i it's bad to say but i want my braces off i don't care about my bite i mean i do care but i don't care enough to take out four teeth because i was already missing muelas from like when i was little and they had to take some muelas out so I already had gaps. Luckily, those gaps closed with the braces, but I don't feel like my jaw will be strong enough. Like, that's what I think with them taking out four teeth. So I decided to tell them. So basically, they told me, like, we can take out four teeth or if you want, we can just call it quits and we can take off your braces now. So at that point, I was just like, I'm not going to take out four teeth. Go ahead and just take my braces off. So they obviously made me sign paperwork um, stating that I was going to take off my braces. But obviously, I my teeth were not completely fixed. That way, like, I can never go back and, like, sue them for whatever reason or just tell them that they didn't do a good job. So, yeah, I agreed to take my braces off. They, as you guys saw in the video before this, they went ahead and did um, my impressions. I think that's what they're called. Um, that way I can have my retainers done and all that and I have my appointment for July 20th so it is in a month and my braces are going to come off that day and I'm so excited because I'm ready I'm ready to have them off before I had braces let me see if I can find a picture and just show you guys really quick before I had my braces I used to smile so freaking much with my teeth even if my teeth were not straight I always used to smile and I only smile with my top teeth. The minute they put my braces, obviously, it made me insecure about my smile. So I stopped smiling. And let me see. Let me go to, like, my old pictures. Mm, okay, so, like, for example, I don't know if you guys can see. But, for example, that picture, obviously, was, like, a hell of long ago. I would smile. Let me, let me, let me. Like that. But... I wouldn't mind my smile you know so now that my teeth are straighter then it'll be okay of course my bite like it's important to a lot of people but it's not so much to me so i'm just done and ready to take them off i cannot wait to have them off but yeah so i just wanted to update you guys on that um look forward to obviously that vlog of me taking off my braces and yeah, I just had some flautas. When I don't know what to eat, I always make myself some flautas de jamón. They were delicious. And I do have videos that I need to record. So I have a lot of stuff to do. Basically, I'm going to restock my henna. That's one of the things that I need to do. Another thing that I need to do is I need to start uploading more on my YouTube. Um... I have a lot of videos that are going to go pending and that are pending already that I need to upload and film. I need to get a gift ready for Father's Day. I'm actually going to get a couple. And um, what else? What else? Oh, I had a photo shoot, but I ended up changing it to this Friday. So I have a photo shoot on Friday. And I was originally going to be like a family photo shoot. I was going to include Sebastian. But since it's going to be in San Francisco and it's going to be kind of late in the afternoon, I know it's going to be cold. And maybe I want to do just like some water shoots. 
so I'm thinking my brother and his wife are gonna babysit Sebastian so I don't take him so it'll just be like a cute photo shoot between me and George you know and yeah my birthday's next week and I just feel like I have so much going on but today I have a freaking mess in the house because Sebastian decided to destroy his room I'll show you guys right now so I'm gonna start cleaning Hopefully get ready so I can film a video at least and yeah, but let me go ahead and show you guys Sebastian's room because Dios mio, I need help <laughs> So this is my current life with the teenager <laughs> With the teenager, well you don't want to get blamed for this mess with teenager and a toddler He doesn't want me to blame him, but it's not him It's Sebastian like Sebastian woke up wanting to do this He's never in his life done such a big mess. Like, he emptied out all his drawers. He emptied out, like, toys that I had in the closet. Um, my brother-in-law has been sleeping here. Just because in our guest room, sometimes Sebastian won't let George sleep. So then sometimes George will sleep there. Um, but we just put this here just in case. And this is where he does his homework in the mornings. Pero miren este. Sebastian. Dios mío, ¿qué hiciste? ¿Qué hiciste? Oh, oh. <laughs> but yeah, you guys like my cleaning videos, so hopefully you guys enjoy this one. Look at his big old diaper. I couldn't find si diapers his size, so I got one size bigger and then they fall like that. Oi, oi, oi. Alright, <laughs> so as part of my day with my teenager over here, what is it? 3520. 3520. See? We have to check his Green. homework. Green. Hardy, okay. <laughs> oh! Get by soon! What'd you do? I did these two. Why does it say 80%? No, because I, I missed one. Oh, okay. And then this is this. That's the one I just finished the radicals thing. We only did a tutorial? Yeah, it was it was fucking thirty five questions. It's a lot. Okay. Alright, T kid. Now go outside and play. Oh my Well sit down and um watch Tom and Jerry and I'll give you a snack. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever you want. <laughs> Guinness. Mickey. Okay, ya listo? Espérate pues. Espérate. ¿Estás bailando? Alrighty, so I'm in my toilet and I had already sprayed it with bleach. So now what I'm gonna do is just fucking scrub. And so you guys want to see like all raw video. But um, basically, I like to scrub my toilet um, pretty much every time that I clean just because it bugs me. I like to have spotless toilet okay so after i already cleaned the inside of the toilet i like to spray all of it um with windex or whatever i have and just clean all of it the sinks i like to spray with bleach also because i tend to wash my face here um, so my makeup, if I don't wash it, like, you can tell that it kind of turns it a little bit of yellow. Okay, so I'm just going to scrub. There we go. So I scrubbed all that bathtub. I got bleach all over my friggin' shorts. I'm just done. All over my shorts. Which is great. I was not thinking. Now I'm gonna clean with Windex on top.
Okay, so it is now clean. It feels good. And I just mopped. So now next thing is my room. Luckily, Sebastian is outside with my nephew. With my nephew. With my brother-in-law. And then they're playing with other kids. So I have time to clean. Okay, it's hard to t focus on the camera. But they're literally walking out with Sebastian's hoop. Look at them. Ah, it's not focusing. But they're gonna go play with the neighbors. <laughs> so they took Sebastian's basketball hoop too. Oh my god. I'm a hot mess. But I don't know who the hell Sebastian thinks he is. A freaking teenager. He's out there playing con todos basketball he has his own hoop but that's cool you know i live in such a beautiful neighborhood and all the neighbors are so nice and of course my brother-in-law is taking care of him but i love the fact that they can both go out have friends and play like in the neighborhood you know okay, so here for example i already made my bed but i'm not comfortable till all this is vacuumed so the vacuum is my best friend I cleaned except for my hot Cheetos because that's my a midnight snack and I just like to have it right there. And yeah, it's me adorno. <laughs> but yeah, let me just vacuum. There we go. That's how I like to see it. Pero now I have a bigger problem. <laughs> I don't even know where to start. <sighs> okay, so it's a little better. I put away his toys in his basket that I'm gonna hide. Uh, put away his horse, made his bed, picked up the mattress. Now basically it's just like all this ropa. I don't know why there's plates, gatorades, and all that stuff in here. I stone taco. But all this was done today morning so yeah and i put most of his shoes over there for now god i basically had one of these for like his daily use shirts one for his shorts and pants um another one was like socks and pjs and then the other one was like his hair stuff his um toothbrush his medicine and all that stuff and another one but yeah um and then like the stuff that he wears like on special occasions stuff i have him hung up in his closet but these are just easy to access but apparently they're easy for him to access too since he decided to do this today Okay, it's a freaking miracle later, and his room is back to being clean. Let's see how long it takes to make it into a mess again. And then I already went ahead and vacuumed this room, too. Let me check up on these kids. Por la ventana. <laughs> They are having a water balloon fight, apparently. <laughs> I love how Sebastian is like a part of them. He knows what a water balloon fight is. Okay, so I cleaned this other bathroom, but now um, they were having a water balloon fight. So I brought Sebastian in for a nap. Always likes to cover his whole face. Twenty twenty. <laughs> okay, I mopped and it's clean. My guest room is clean. Yes, I did it. Okay, so I wanted to actually show you guys that his jumper had a big hole and then we would try and fix it and stuff and nothing was able to get it together so 
yesterday i went to walmart and i bought like some bike patching and i went ahead and patched it um so far it's going good because before the air would just come out immediately so let's see if that works but yeah that's clean i just gotta clean the kitchen which is not a big old mess but somewhat Alrighty, it is officially clean. So I just sat down right where I started the video, but I'm going to go ahead and end this mini cleaning video here. I hope you guys really enjoyed it. I hope I inspired you ladies to clean because you guys let me know that every time that I do a cleaning video, it inspires you. And I need to go chug some water because I'm really tired. But I'm going to go shower, and then after I shower, I'll probably start with dinner. But yeah, thank you so much for watching this video, and I will see you guys all on my next one. Bye, guys. <laughs>